Hi guys, welcome back. So today I'm going to show you how you can do the plank board wall on the dollhouse. Okay, you need to get some very skinny coffee stirrers. And when you do that, then you want to break them to the length that you're going to need to install them. Okay, so for instance, I want to put some right here. I'm going to use some Loctite Crazy Glue. All right, and then the other thing I need to do is I need to prepare my wallpaper by pulling it back. So, I'm going to semi-measure this, and I'm going to say it's about right there. I'll break that off, and I'm going to put it behind the wallpaper, just like that. Hold it there for a second so the Loctite can catch it. Then you're going to repeat this process. Sorry that it's bumping. I have like limited space here to work with. Um, you know, oh, I did not have enough on there or it was not attached all the way. So we're going to put that back up there. Okay, now you're going to repeat that and go all the way down the entire wall the same way. And I want to leave a tiny space in between them because the lathe walls or plank board walls, wherever you're at, depends on what you call them. Um, in Maryland, they call them lathe walls, but I'm going to go ahead and do that all the way down in this little hidden section. And you can put this up with hot glue as well, but um, hot glue is going to be hard to get in there to show you guys and have you be able to see it. Now that one I broke off because I want it to look like it's jointed. With like a broken piece in the middle. Okay. Now that that's done, I can take this part of my wallpaper and I can glue it back in place where I want it to be. And you want to continue that all the way down. I'm going to pause you guys so that I can do it. And then um, that way I can get it installed without having to move around the camera and everything. And then I'll show it to you when I'm done. Okay, so this is what it looks like. 
but it's got to be aged because that's just not going to work for what we're going for. So I'm going to take some of my spray paint that I have mixed up and I'm going to spritz it. Absorb it in. Get some of this stuff out of the way. So I'm just going to blot it off. And let it dry. how you do the plank board wall behind the wallpaper. All right, I can do that on the rest of it or I can leave the rest of it plain. It doesn't really matter, it's all choice. But that's how you do a plank board wall. All right, like and subscribe, leave your questions, suggestions, or comment below and follow the Facebook page for lots more um, photos and stuff. And definitely check out the calendar because I will post on the calendar that's on the website what is coming next and what's to be expected. All right, thanks a lot. Have a wonderful, wonderful day.